get off the right wheel. We've got something else to talk about with Daily Dimes. This is another ace in the pocket that I think Nelson should reveal. And I'm going to have him start with why he got interested in Daily Dimes and the prepaid business and speak to how he got in the business and hand off to Cynthia and Amber. No worries. Well, before I do that, that's a 50-mile HD TV antenna. 50-mile. Success rate should be in excess of 95%. Somebody may, may be next to a nuclear power plant or out in a rural area and the reception may not be so good, but your success rate should be way up there. So with the addition of that and the TV box, I say BAM! Yeah! All right, let's talk Daily Dimes. Daily Dimes, Daily Dimes. What is Daily Dimes? Daily Dimes is a membership benefit offer. Now, I will tell you in my vast experience of direct marketing, and it is vast, I've seen virtually everything that's been put on TV, put on the internet. I've seen it, pretty much all of it. Most of the time when you hear the word membership, it means fluff, no substance. That's not the case here. Daily Dimes, I, could, I, I first originally started thinking about Daily Dimes probably five years ago. Because I was like, you know, I've got this Starwoods American Express card in my pocket, and I've got this Costco card in my pocket, and, you know, honestly, I'm a one percenter. I don't need to be loyal to a card. Not going to make a difference in my life, right? But one friend of mine said, hey, Nelson, you know, you got to get this Costco card, man. You know, you buy your stuff there. The prices are good. You get this rebate check at the end of every year. You go to Costco, you get stuff for free. You know, poor man needs a bargain. Rich man loves a bargain. That's the way it goes. It's always been that way. So I got my Costco card, having a good time, and I had a Platinum American Express card that I used for business. And, you know, I never really got anything with my Platinum American Express card. Yeah, I got a, you know, a ticket here, or there, a flight here or there, but it really never was valuable to me, never, mount, never impressed me. So another friend of mine who actually is an executive in a jet charter business, who never flies private, by the way, said, Nelson, you got to get the Starwoods card. I went, why? He goes, just trust me. I went, all right. Successful guy, he's smart. I know he knows what he's doing. I didn't even really get into details. I didn't ask all those questions like, you know, tell me, the, tell me how it works and all the rest of it. I just got the card. So the first time I used the card, like my family likes to ski. I don't know if anybody here skis, but expensive, expensive pastime. Ridiculous. Stupid ridiculous. <laughs> I don't like paying for it. I don't. It offends me how much money you spend per day. So we got, I said to my wife, use the, use the points off the Starwoods card. She comes back, she goes, you're not going to believe what we got. So she showed me Starwoods property, hotel, flights, whatever. I did the math. The Starwood points were, one Starwood point was worth four and a half platinum points. It was so good that we exchanged our platinum points that we had for Starwood points, and even with the exchange, I was 1,500 bucks ahead on the points that I exchanged. Would, would that make you a believer? Yeah. Made me a believer. That's the background that, that's put my mind in the mindset that, hey, you know, maybe there's an opportunity here. Oh, what's that? <laughs> so. Why the prepaid industry? What's that? 2014, preferred met method of payment, number one, debit cards, another name for a prepaid card, 43%. Number two, credit card, 35%. Number three, cash, 9%. In 2008, what happened? Mortgage crisis. Big problem. A lot of people got hurt, right? A lot of people got hurt. I'm sure a lot of people in this audience got hurt. It was a terrible, terrible thing. But in 2008, leading up to 2008, those numbers weren't only reversed. Credit card purchases and cash far outweighed 
well, at least credit card purchases were way ahead of prepaid card purchases. Anybody with me? After 2008, there was a paradigm shift. Things changed. Credit card purchases started to diminish as a percentage of overall purchases, and prepaid card purchases started to increase. I noticed this trend. Was I in this field? No, but I'm a marketer. I like to develop products and services that, that have value and add, enhance people's lives. So I started thinking to myself, the prepaid business, honestly, it's a, it's a commodity. It's boring. I mean, net spend, the life of an average net spend card, anybody know how long, how, how long the average life of a net spend card is? Three months. I know you're going to think years. It's months. Months. Three months. What a joke. So I said, okay, there's a, there's a niche here. There's a void. What if there was a prepaid card with, pro, with benefits and reward programs that rivaled or surpassed those of many credit card companies? And that's when there was the Daily Dimes. Now, Daily Dimes is a little comparison. Like I said, it's a membership club. It's $19.95 a month. You will be able to market Daily Dimes to friends, family, neighbors, whatever, for $19.95 a month. You can see you have Rush Card at $7.95. They have a $2.50. I, I'm not going to read my paper because I can't read anymore unless it's big. But $2.50 ATM fee, as does account now, as does net spend. You know, they have additional transaction fees. The, the Daily Dimes program, if you use the card, it doesn't have transaction fees. We have one benefit after another. Dimes. What's a dime? A dime is a virtual currency. That virtual currency can be exchanged for pre-clip Sunday insert coupons. Can I go up ahead to a couple of slides? Stop. Tiffany, look familiar? When you see this brown pa paper envelope in your mail, that's from us. Not going to look like junk mail. It's not going to get lost. You see those coupons? That's what we're talking about, the holy grail of savings at pharmacies and grocery stores across the country. This is a little screenshot, and they're going to have a little training after this. I'm just giving you the 30,000 foot. This is a screenshot of the shopping cart where you put in the quantity of coupons you want. You click add, and blah, blah, blah. The little scissor runs around. It's really cute, animated, and it adds to your cart. You got a register up there that tells you about the total savings that you're acquiring. Next slide, please. Oh, by the way, no, go back. Where's my, re my restaurant? Restaurant coupons. Anything look familiar? One more, please. Grocery store coupons. By the way, you're not clipping them. We are. Clip, 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 clip. They come to you in an envelope. They're all clipped nice and neat. You just go save the money. Just go save the money. No fuss, no muss. I delivered newspapers when I was a kid. Washington Post. When I came home, I was covered with newspaper, news ink. Right? I was also covered with paper fibers. That's disgusting, dirty. Trust me, don't clip coupons in your kitchen. It's unsanitary. Not cool. So that's coupons. Then we have gift cards. Gift cards from major merchants. CVS, uh, Amazon, Walmart, uh, Brookstone. I mean, there's, they go on and on. Zappos, my favorite shoe place for the kids. They have the sizes we need. And these gift cards are available for purchase. Or you can redeem your reward points for gift cards. You can redeem reward points for cash back. What else we got? Oh, this, you know, I really enjoy this. Aretha, are you in this audience? Aretha Young? You're a winner. You're a winner. Michelobi Lewis, are you in this audience? You are? You're a winner too. 
Vanessa Van Pelt, are you here? You know what you won? Roku. This is only three of a dozen winners we've had in less than, in less than two months. Folks, this is getting a lot of traction. This is fun stuff. This, by the way, isn't, you know, maybe, maybe somebody's going to win. Somebody's going to win because each sweepstakes has a limited number of entries, and once that entry is met, there's a winner. I expect to do a dozen a week. I expect to do a dozen, a dozen sweepstakes winners a day. If you have dimes and you haven't redeemed them for coupons yet, they expire every week. Either convert them to reward points or, or take a chance. But everybody, but everybody every, every sweepstakes has a winner. Unlike Publishers Clearinghouse where you have, I know what the odds are because I know the business, one in 1.6 billion chance of winning. No, I mean, you know how many winners? There's like no winners. It's once in a, once in a, Solar eclipse or something. <laughs> so, I will tell you this. Where's my, can we find this slide? Let me explain why I really like this business. It's freaking huge. It's, it's, not, it's not huge, it's not Donald Trump huge, it's huge. <laughs> Don't have it? Control room, let's go back. There we go. Stop. It's, <laughs> say it with me. It's huge. <laughs> 2015. This, the, by the way, these, these are in billions. These aren't supposed to be percentages. I had this reproduced. These are dollars, not percentages. I had it reproduced because mine was blurry, right? So cash purchases, 2015, 50.7 billion. I'm sorry, 2010, 50.7 billion. 2015, 47.3 billion. That's a decline in cash purchases of 7%. I'm not surprised, are you? Checks. 17 billion in checks in 2010, 11.2 billion in 2015, down 34%. Are you surprised? A lot of places won't even take checks anymore, right? Not surprised. Credit cards, 21.2 billion in 2010, 31.4 billion in 2015. It had an increase, no doubt. People like to use their credit cards. Debit cards. I, I told you what happened before 2008. In 2008, there was a paradigm shift. It's real. You can do your history. I'm not making this stuff up. But after 2008, it, it shifted dramatically because the, the mortgage crisis was so terrible. It was so horrific. So in 2010, the credit card purchases were $21 billion, and the, in 2015, $31 billion. So it's up 48%, healthy increase. But by 2010, Prepaid purchases were already double credit card purchases from 2007, where they were behind. That's a paradigm shift, a huge paradigm shift. So in 2015, prepaid purchases are $63.8 billion. That's the market we're going after. You know, Marshall said it. Best. One, any percent of that, I'm good with. Any percent of that, I'm in. Give me one percent, give me one tenth of one percent of that, and I'm, I'm, I'm going to be smiling around my head. <laughs> Electronic payments, you know, they don't, they're not consumer based. So, I'm asking you to open your mind to the possibility, to the opportunity, because it's knocking really loud. You have a financial vehicle, a financial instrument that is unequaled. You have an opportunity that's unequaled. Why? Because we're in network marketing. And just like my friend Craig said to me, you need to get this Starwoods card. He didn't say it. He wasn't making any money on it, by the way. He didn't make a penny. It wasn't what it was about. Friend to friend. You need this. you got to use this. Try it. 
If you don't, you're missing out. This is the same thing. Oh, but it's $19.95 a month. Oh, but you get $50 a week in grocery coupons. Oh, you got a $1 ATM fee. I mean, you don't even need it. Just try it. You're going to save money. There's people in this audience. Tiffany, what do you save a month on your card? Hundreds of dollars a month by using the card? Between the groceries? By the way, there's an ebook. And by the way, you get reward points for everything. But you need to share this with, your, with people that you want to do a favor. You're doing them a favor. And if you engage and you get involved in the Daily Dimes experience, you'll know you're doing them a favor. And what's the easiest thing in the world to share? Something that you believe in. You know, I'm speaking to you, I think you get it. I have conviction. I have conviction in everything I do, or I don't do it. I can't fake it. It's not in me. You, get, you engage, and you get experience, and it's like I said at the beginning, if a great opportunity presents itself, say yes. And if you don't know how to do it, learn how later. This is exactly why I love that quote. A lot of you don't understand Daily Dimes. You need to. We have women here from, da women, uh, from Daily Dimes, Cynthia, Michelle, and Amber, who are here to help you outside. And with that, I'm going to turn it over to Tiffany Am and Amber. Uh, Amber? Amber. Gonna, Amber Williamson's coming out. She's an expert on the subject. Please give her a warm welcome and much success. Green for go. Green for go. Hello, Five Links. My name is Amber Williamson. I'm the call center manager and the product trainer for Daily Dimes. As you know by now, your new pay card is powered by Daily Dimes. What does that mean? What is Daily Dimes? I've had a lot of people ask. Daily Dimes is a membership program that's designed to save you money on your everyday purchases while offering a smart, safe alternative to traditional banking. You score reward points with it. How, can you, how many times have you heard me say the word score out in the lobby? You get reward points for virtually everything you do on our website. And I have no slides. Ta-da. So I'm going to keep going, guys. You score reward points for virtually everything you do on our website. And you can score even more when you take advantage of the Daily Dimes prepaid MasterCard. If you haven't already heard, you get reward points every time. Please get me my slides. Daily Dimes membership, thank you guys. So as you can see, you score reward points for virtually everything you do on the website. Now that you're selling the Daily Dimes prepaid MasterCard, it's included in the membership. This is what the card looks like that you'll be selling. Anyone who adds funds to the cards or makes purchases score reward points. Reward points are redeemable for e-gift cards, cash back to your card, dimes, our virtual currency, and our clip and ship coupon clipping services. Matter of fact, every single one of you that's part of the Platinum Discount Network has enough reward points the minute that you log in to score a register, excuse me, to redeem them for a $10 e-gift card of your choice. As you're selling Daily Dimes, think about that. The minute your customers log in, if they're an ultra member, they get the $10 e-gift card too. That's 2,000 reward points. That's half the cost of their membership. Dimes. You keep hearing Nelson talk about dimes. You hear us talk about reward points. Dimes are our virtual currency. They're redeemable for clip and ship handling fees. I'll tell you about that in a minute. And admin fees. Dime sweeps. You guys are familiar with the sweeps now because we have a bunch of winners. As well as reward points. As an Ultra member, you receive 200 dimes per month redeemable for our clip and ship services, dime sweeps, or reward points. 
They're issued weekly. You get 50 a week. They also expire weekly. If you're not taking advantage of your dimes, you're losing money. You're going to say, why? Each dime is just a dime. It's equivalent to 10 cent in our clip and ship handling fees. Every 10 cent handling fee is going to get you a dollar manufacturer coupon. So each week, if you redeem all 50 dimes for $50 in clip and ship coupons and you take advantage of those savings, that's $200 a month, $2,400 a year. Who can use an extra $2,400? And that's just the beginning. As you can see, we've had several winners from Five Links lately playing the sweeps. Guys, redeem the dimes. You're gonna, if you don't use them, you lose them. So you might as well take advantage of it for the Roku's, high boost, high energy, Montevita, it's all there, plus gift cards, reward points, more dimes. Take advantage of the services. And I know you've heard a little bit about the ebook from Miss Tiffany King. The ebook is one of the greatest benefits of this membership. When you download it, it's a training guide that you can use at your information sessions, or as we call them, the PBRs. You'll learn one thing that I learned. I learned how to create an endless cycle of savings. I have two kids, 17-year-old son and a seven-year-old daughter, who now sell Daily Dimes themselves. My daughter knows that if she wants something from the grocery store, I guarantee you she's bringing me a coupon. So I'm going to show you all my, my savings receipts in a minute. You'll learn to think twice. After you start using the coupons, an example, if I have $200 I set aside for groceries, I physically take my coupons and I replace it with the money because I pay first with coupons. Next, I pay with my free gift cards. And then after that, I'm going to pay with my Daily Dimes prepaid MasterCard because I'm going to score more reward points so I get more gift cards, more cash back, and more of the benefits every single time. Ben and Jerry's. It's actually Miss Cynthia's favorite, who works with me at Daily Dimes. One example right here, guys, one. It was originally $38.32. She bought one product now. With the savings that, and the tips and the techniques from the ebook, she was able to walk out of the store saving 92%. She got eight for the less than the price of one. Ben and Jerry's for 40 cent, 40 cent a pint. You're not going to see it, and you're not going to pay it full price anymore if you have daily dimes. As a matter of fact, isn't that almost the same as the cost of your platinum discount network on one item? What happens when you use the coupons on every single item in your cart? That's what happens. This is what happens when I go to the store. I'm paid to shop. I get paid to walk out of the store. As you can see right there, the first time, grand total, negative $5.87. How much did I save? $85.43. How? Because I used the ebook. I did not coupon and I did not see the value in it until I wrote it with Miss Cynthia and Michelle. $226.11 savings. Got paid again. These were for a couple of our events where we did some charitable work. We spent $103 and we saved a hundred and oh actually I'm sorry, we saved $259. Who could use an extra $259 a week? Did other examples off one product? One. 
The total ended up being negative 42 cents, but we still saved $22. That's one product. How many products do you buy at a time? The coupons are there. Do not pay full retail price. So, reward points. Everybody scores reward points. You get 50 reward points when you take advantage of our RX discount card. We support the troops with it. Every time someone uses that card, 50 cents goes to charitable organizations like Wounded Warrior, <laughs> Operation Gratitude, and our own program that's called Do For Our Nation. When the coupons expire at Daily Dimes, we don't throw them away, we recycle them. Every single one of them goes to the military overseas because they can use them for six months beyond the expiration. When you use the RX discount card, you can get seven, up to 75% off prescriptions at over 60,000 pharmacies, pharmacies nationwide. It works for the entire family, including the pets. It does. Couple of easy ways to score reward points. So you work on your second gift card, because everybody has one waiting if you're part of the Platinum Discount Network. Confirm your email address, simple. Watch the videos on the home page. They're about three quarters of the way down. And every month that you remain an active member, you're gonna get another 250 reward points. But it doesn't stop there. Your customers and you, the members of the Platinum Discount Network, if you load your card from, with funds from a source other than five links, you get one reward point for every single dollar you deposit up to 2,500 the first time, the first time you're loading it within 30 days of card activation. That's another $10 gift card if you max it. If you direct deposit, you get one reward point for every dollar directly deposited up to 2,000. What is that? Another gift card, another $10. Signature purchases. Anytime you swipe your card, you score one reward point for every dollar you spend when you select credit. How many people have run credit lately? Y'all, you scoring reward points? I did, I bought a Coke for $4, but I got double reward points because I direct deposit more than $500 a month. Two reward points for every single dollar you spend when you select credit if you're adding funds from a source other than five links. I probably get about 50 to $70 easy every single month just by doing the things that I do every single day. Get my McDonald's Coke. I pay my electric, I pay my water. I buy gas, pay my car payment, rent, groceries. When you build the habit, the reward points will just rack up. They're gonna be, you're, there's so many of them that you're not even gonna be able to count. We keep track of them for you though. So what am I gonna do? I'm gonna take advantage of my membership benefits. And for you guys, it's free with the Platinum Discount Network. It's valued at $19.95. But y'all are getting it, you're not paying a dime. Not paying a dime. As a matter of fact, I've seen a ton of people getting cash back already. They're getting cash back to their card. They're redeeming their reward points for dimes. Clip and ship coupons. More money, more money. Let me give you more money. Mo money. Cash rebates, if someone purchases our clip and ship services with a Daily Dimes pay card, excuse me, the Daily Dimes Five Links pay card, or your customer purchases it with a Daily Dimes prepaid MasterCard, 
They're gonna get 50% cash rebates on their first three clip and ship orders. They get up to 10% on every order after that. It's issued as credit right back to the card. Gift cards, holidays, birthdays, you don't have to go anywhere anymore. Not only is Daily Dimes gonna save you the gas, we're gonna save you time, and we're gonna pay you to do it. You can get five per, up to 5% cash rebates on gift cards when you purchase them from Daily Dimes. Look for the cards with the logos. So now you're getting cash back, you're getting cash rebates, you're getting gift cards, all because you have a pay card? It's supercharged. Everyone has a cardholder self-service site. Why? Because this is a regular, it's just like a traditional bank. You have an ABA routing and account number. You can manage your direct deposit. You can do card to card transfers. My son's on spring break right now. He is on his way to um, Chattanooga, Tennessee. Let me tell you, what did I do this morning? Send him money. How fast did I do it? That fast. Instant. I know a lot of you have multiple cards, multiple accounts because you have five links businesses. You can transfer it to your partner instantly. You can set up SMS text alerts so that you can see when your money hits, where you're spending your money. And it's gonna remind you if you select debit. If you enter the four digit pin, it's gonna tell you to select credit so you get the reward points. You also have access to online statements. Where can you find it, right? You need to know where to find it. It's on the card carrier that your card came with. ABA routing and account number is also the best way to pay your bills or to send and receive money. And of course, you need it for direct deposit. Speaking of, as you're out there selling Daily Dimes membership, keep in mind that the best way to keep your residual income coming in is to get them set up on direct deposit. Because when direct deposit's there, we're collecting the fees, which means you guys are gonna get paid. <laughs> prepaid, it's a prepaid card, right? You can get checks. You can get checks. I don't know of any other prepaid card out there where you can get checks. You can call card services and request them. We do have a, an additional level of security though because we want to keep your accounts, your money safe. All you have to do is call for an authorization code. Now, let me clarify. Your ATM as a part of the Platinum Discount Network is less. The dollar is for your customers. And there's no ATM surcharges on the MoneyPass network. None. I've used the card now, the, the red, the ruby one, for about three years, testing it, playing with it, trying to figure it out. All I know is that all I get is reward points. A lot. It's a prepaid MasterCard, so you can use it anywhere that MasterCard is accepted. Plus, you're protected with the MasterCard zero liability. So if there's any, any unauthorized charges, call card services, they'll take care of you. Lots of questions about moving money. So you can move money via PayPal if you're not transferring it card to card, which is free. I gave you the website. Pop money. Your bank that has your money is Metropo Metropolitan Commercial Bank of New York. They're a pop money bank. If you're part of the pop money network, you can pay bills through that pop money network. If you have other bank accounts, some of you, I know SunTrust in Florida actually is a pop money bank, so you can move the money directly to the card. You can also move money out if you need to. And TO, you can pay hundreds of billers in seconds, utilities, auto, mortgage, if you need to. But I always, always suggest using the card. Select credit, because what are you going to get? Reward points. And thank you.
Happy savings!